Hey guys, so today we're making some fried potatoes and onions. Please make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let's get started with the recipe. So I am starting with four Idaho potatoes. You're just gonna slice your uh, potatoes. You don't wanna make them too thick, but you also don't wanna make them too thin. I may have made them a little bit too thin, but that's okay, they still turned out really, really great. Um, and so you're just gonna put them in some cold water so that they won't turn brown. And you wanna make sure that you wash your potatoes because we don't want no dirty potatoes, y'all. You wanna wash it until the water runs clear in your bowl um, to get all of that excess starch off of there. And so I am just slicing up one large onion. Um, if you don't like a lot of onion, you can use like half of an onion. Um, and then after we wash our potatoes, we're just going to dry them off a little bit um, because we want to get as much water off as possible. I am using a clean dish towel just to dry my potatoes off. And so now I'm using my cast iron skillet and I am using about two tablespoons of oil. I'm using avocado oil um, and then I'm going to use about two tablespoons of butter. And then we're just gonna put our potatoes and our onions in here and let it cook, guys. This is a really simple dish. Um, I'm gonna layer this. So I'm gonna put half of the potatoes in there, half of the onions, and then I'm gonna put more potatoes and then onions on top of that. Um, and you wanna make sure that you season every layer, okay? You can season it to your taste. Just make sure your food is not bland. We don't want no bland food, y'all. And so after I seasoned my potatoes, I just added about two tablespoons of butter on top and then I put a lid on it and let it cook for about 10 minutes or so. And then you're gonna flip your potatoes over. Um, try to be careful with your potatoes so that they don't break apart. And you want your potatoes to be nice and brown and have a nice crust on it. Look at those potatoes, y'all. And so um, after you flip them, you are going to add some oil or butter if you feel like your uh, potatoes are starting to stick to the skillet please taste your food as you go you're gonna see me sneak a little taste in here to make sure the the flavor was on point y'all and so i put the lid back on it and let it cook until it was fork tender and then i'm just finishing it off with some parsley flakes and that's it you guys this is super easy this is perfect for breakfast perfect for brunch you can even eat this for dinner Serve it with some bacon or some sausage, some eggs. Oh my goodness, I'm getting hungry just making this video, y'all. Please make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe. See you next time. Bye.